Hey guys, it's Mark from Mark and Michelle. I wanted to do a really quick video. Um, it's Friday. I'm driving. <laughs> um, but it's just one of the, what's on my mind and what's on my heart right now is, uh, you know, just, just not giving up. You know, it's so easy when, you know, people, when roadblocks come along just to say, you know, I, I can't do this or it's just, it's just not worth it. I don't, I don't see a, a means to an end, you know, that light at the end of the tunnel, that's just a train coming at me. You know, what I'm here to tell you, it's not, you know, I, I, you know, I think we all get those feelings at times and we all want to, we all want what we want and we're willing to work for it sometimes it just gets uh, life gets in the way or life just gets confusing you know there's a lot of craziness going on out there there's a lot of finger pointing there's a lot of you know just just a lot and sometimes you just want to just want to give up and that's what I used to do just give up um, I can't I cannot give up I will not give up Anybody that, that comes along for the ride with me is going to find out that I will never, ever give up. You know, we got some uh, some news over the last few days, and some of it's very sad, some of it's alarming, some of it's worrisome. But I know that if I keep going in the direction that I'm going, that everything is going to work out. That I've come so far in the last year. I mean, a lot of you don't realize where I've been or where, what all I put my family through, you know, what all they've been through because of me, and I can't give up because they deserve better, because they deserve to be happy, joyous, and free, and I will do anything and everything in my power to make that happen. I have to. Um, <laughs> I just have to. You know, it's a... Uh, it's a long story. You know, I lost my job. Lost a lot of things. Um, mostly, I lost myself, and I'm finding myself. And I, I like the direction I'm going in, and I like the direction that we're going to end up at, or the point we're going to end up end up at, because we we can already see it. We 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 know what it is, and we know how to get there, and we're going to do whatever it takes to get there. Looking for anybody else that, that has that same kind of you know drive or same kind of feeling that you know just where, where they're at right now is just not where they wanted to be. You know, if somebody asked me or I was reading something, probably more likely, you know, what did you want to be when you were 16? You know, and I had to think. I had to think for a long time. I don't remember what I wanted to be when I was 16. If you asked me when I was 12, I wanted to be a Major League Baseball player. I wanted to be the next Ernie Banks. For those of you old enough to know who Ernie Banks is, God bless you. Um, but when I was 16, I just wanted to be, I wanted to be accepted. I wanted to be part of something that I didn't feel like I was. I wanted to fit in, you know, and I, I never did. I was so worried about what other people thought that, you know, I never allowed myself to fit in anywhere. Or the ones that I did fit in with, I didn't want to be part of that group because there's other better groups. You know, I've learned the hard way that you can't live like that. That you are who you are, and that you have a lot of amazing people around you, and you need to hold on to those people, and you need to cherish those people, and you need to love those people. And you need to take care of those people because they're the ones who are going to take care of you. And like I said, life's too short. You know, there's been a lot of death around, a lot of uh, sickness, a lot of injuries, and you know that's just life happening. You know, it's going to happen regardless of what we're doing, right? So we might as well be headed in the right direction and learning a new mindset so we can uh, learn how to deal with all this stuff that's happening. That's what's on my mind. That's what's in my heart. I just wanted to share that with you. It's Friday. Happy Friday. I'm going to go in this here building and 
do what I gotta do. All right, I will talk to you later.